Maybe goes back to the Aurelian Soul. Crowd seems to be happy about it. Yeah, he, he has looked really good when he has played it, but it's Ooh. not. Oh, okay. Last second swap to Cassiopeia. And they were able to get a, a, a first blood against Immortals with this. So they're going to come around behind Jensen. Jensen will not expect oh, it. Oh, belly they got Hook in there as well. Who is going to follow in with the damage? Jensen's just dead. That's first blood. Almost 70%. The That's a lot. That's a lot. Mate, they must have not seen the first blood then. <laughs> Oh, here comes second blood, perhaps. Meteos going in, Impact gonna flash for over Dashan, trying to get aggressive. Meteos comes back down, Dashan trying to flip away! Oh my god, he traded! Darshan with the outplay, and Impact is the one who blows his flash. Trying to bait, but not happening this time. Sneaking in with some pokes, Dixie with a nice bell shield play back from Afro. Damage oh, there, he gets hooked. Snare's already down, Dixie gonna take additional damage. Sneaky trying to weave a few more auto attacks in. And Afro moves, taking a lot of damage supports. Getting low, Dixie going back in, heal burnt by Cloud9. There's just action everywhere. So Smithy is really protecting Darshan. They know they have the early lead. They don't want to throw it away. Uh, with Oh, good everything. ulti from Hui. Gets him out of the tower. Jensen taking damage, and that's just an outplay. He got absolutely smashed there. He got stunned under the turret. No chance to get out, and Jensen gets too far forward. They know where he is, and it, it, they, they saw him go over the red, so yep. they may look for the collapse. They're coming. Yep, Sneaky's already here. Smoothie actually up as well. Look, Smithy does have everything available, but already taking damage. Lance is there. Aframu gonna make sure he gets out. So far this game, and they're going aggressive on a Darshan. Pretty far up. Can Medios get the cocoon? Smithy is coming. Darshan actually got back in a hyper. Hops away. Needs a little more speed. Does have flash. Flash is a cocoon. Medios burns the summoners there. Summoner trade, uh, but a good wait. By Darshan. We talked about interrupting. Oh, oh Jensen with the turn. Goes for the big play, but Jensen going to shove him back away. Can't afford to fight, though. Hui with another aggressive attempt. They, they saw him. They pinged it out. So Medios knows he is there. Oh. Spiderling going to chase him out. Yep, that forces Dick Smithy away. So going to cover Jensen here. Hui does. Still pushing up. Good flash in. But he, uh, Ultimate does not get him out from under the turret, though, and Jensen flashes out. So far, so good. Darshan. Yeah, in again. Impact actually forced to burn the pillar. Darshan flashes in. Now Meganar maybe going to flash in for it. That's a flash force by Impact, though. Darshan wins a very good trade. Smithy hits Cocoon, but Stix is here as well. CLG just going to force down mid. Still stuck here in mid lane. Well, it's just such a tough start for C9 because a lot of their lanes kind of got screwed oh, up by this. And Sneaky. and Sneaky is dueling up here very aggressively. Yeah, Stix just stands his ground. Almost takes out Sneaky. Tina had an extra, but Darshan now going to slow impact. And I don't think he's got anywhere good to run. No flash left available. Now Mega going to slam him into the wall. Talia's trying to save him out. Darshan gets him. And now over the wall, Darshan escapes. At this, that's two turrets to zero. Now Lantern gets him out safely. Afro, as always, with the exit. And Jensen's getting 1v1 again. Both summoners committed there by Huhi. The impact cannot stay in CLG. Oh, are winning this race. Impact gonna try and slow them down, but it's just gonna get hooked for it. Might even get killed here as Jensen's made his way down. Blocks him up for the wall. Sticks they fought to flash out of the way. Afro though, taking turret. Aggro. The CLG wanna go back in. Cloud9 with a successful defense so far. Yeah, they're low though, and this is looking like it may go down. The bases are coming in from the Cloud9 uh, duo. Oh, Jensen doesn't get hooked. Afro gets shoved out of the way, and the angle's not quite there. Almost gets himself killed as a result. So close to being. A disaster for C9, but maybe not enough. Smithy coming around, who he is well, if oh, you want to die. Darshan got Cocoon, very nicely played. Oh, he doesn't get him, but he tags Smoothie and Impact on the end with a no. Now Impact caught out position, is going to get himself played. Who is going to join his wing in from the Lantern, and that's two kills for CLG. Two for zero, dare they go over to Bear, and they do have Cassiopeia. They are going to go for yeah. it, yeah. Well, so he's just actually going to base for more HP, and they're going to make the risky call. Medios needs to come over, they need to contest. Oh, Medios got caught! Ulti for Huhi! Repels out of the way, and Huhi's going to try and shut him down. Doesn't quite get the Miasma down, but Medios pretty much had whatever he wanted there. Jensen, though, going to come to his rescue, but CLG, they're going to get Baron off this, I think. Yeah, it's looking like it's gone. No way for Medios to get there. The clean Baron from CLG, and they are looking dominant the CLG lineup as far as both front and backside initiation. Hui again burns a flash in. It's going to rush for it. Impact zones him out of the way, but the turret's dead. CLG with plenty of cooldowns left to play with. Yeah, and Jensen took a fair bit of damage there. He's down to half. A little bit of poke onto Sneaky, so Summoner ulti burned from Cassiopeia. CLG will back off as that is down, and Meganar going to be gone pretty soon too. Hui just not afraid 
to build a trigger. I think he's used his flash on cooldown pretty much whenever he's Ziggy at the Oh, Sneaky! Not away as he tries to dash out! And Darshan on a killing spree as he takes him out. Yeah, he dash flash just gets pulled back by Darshan. You're not going anywhere, Sneaky. And CLG look to break the base. Yeah, that's gonna crack it here by the looks of things. Cloud9, 4v5, can't really defend. Hui in the middle of the base gonna take out Meteor Solo. Medios again, down shields, good, but the poison still ticking down. Does fall down, Afro flashes in, takes out Smoothie. There's the bomb back, play enough to impact. That'll force the flash, but Darshan straight into the enemy team. Impact is dead as Nog gets a double, and CLG are going nuts. We're 24 minutes into the game. They're diving the Nexus turrets. What's happening? Well, new CLG, apparently, they're going to get the mid inhib as well. And this gold lead is absolutely ridiculous. Cloud9 battered, bruised, and real down at this point. Are they going to go for it again? Yep, same yep. trick. I mean, he's got Spell Shield. Like, what is he really afraid of? Just hits it, starts hitting the turret. Wall there trying to block them off, but Jensen doesn't get it. Darshan slowed up, gets shoved back in. Now has to flash out of the way. Ulti in, actually lands onto a couple, but not quite enough. Six A getting low. Sneaky got aggressive in the bottom lane as well. And actually, Smithy now has to get himself over the wall. Does make it through the trees, but CLG took a little too much damage there. They did. Uh, but the dragon's gonna start doing their work. You can see them regening back up here. That turret, it's looking like it's there as it's super, super low, and it will go down. They're gonna look for a second inhibitor. Dutch on that! Oh, big play! Smithy just spin nail sneaky. And he gets another Jensen caught up. He's gonna get himself killed as well. Hui with a double kill now as CLG is going off in this game. Supers are coming in the mid lane. This could be it. Looks like it might be. Gonna break the bottom in here just in case, but they might not need it. Nexus turret one gonna start to be assaulted. Hui's gonna zone them out of the way, and there it's. First turret going down, 25 and 35 seconds left on the other two. And I think CLG have done it here. CLG with the near perfect game one, 12 to one, 27 minutes in, a dominating performance looking over Cloud9. Looking awfully good in game one, but not done yet. If that's any indicator though, CLG could well and truly be back. Upward trend indeed. <laughs>